All right. So money. One word, money. What is money? Money is essentially what we use to trade to obtain a good, a want, a need, anything, right? And I'm going to be upfront about this, right? You cannot be a trader and love your money at the same time, right? You just can't because when you're that attached to money, the second you start losing it, right, you get super emotional. And when you become super emotional, that's when you begin to overtrade, you begin to practice bad habits, right? Because you're not thinking objectively, you're thinking emotionally, right? And that's probably the best way, in my opinion, to detach yourself from money is to approach something from an objective standpoint. What I mean by objective standpoint is being realistic, looking at the facts, looking at what you can control, right? So what I'm getting at is detach yourself from money, but don't lose the appreciation for it, right? Because let's say, okay, I'm up $300 and then I just lose those $300 and I'm okay with it because I don't give a fuck about money. But now you just broke even and you defeat you defeated the purpose, right? So as a trader, right, one of the main things you should be focusing on is um is capital preservation, right? So appreciate money, appreciate when it comes, but don't let it be an attachment to you, right? If you know you need to let it go or if you know that you take a loss, right, own up to it. Right. Because at the end of the day, money will come and go. So don't sweat it. Right. Just as much as you lost, it can come right back. Right. And that's the cool thing about this industry. Right. I just lost one percent, three hundred dollars, whatever. Cool. Because now I know that if I was correct, right, I would have made those three hundred dollars. And it's very like it's a very basic concept, but it's honestly one of the most important because the money is always going to be there. So what are you going to get out of it if you just let it bring you down or just or even get over your head? Nothing, right? Because at the end of the day, like I said before, we're nobody in this market, right? So appreciate the money that comes in, but do not be attached to it because the second you become attached to it and you start seeing losses, right? You're going to get that, you know, adversity come in that's completely unnecessary and potentially you start seeing failure in the process. So, and that's something that I don't want for any of you, right? So, like I said, I'm going to keep saying it. I'm going to repeat it even on zoom calls or anything. Detach yourself from money, but don't lose the appreciation for it. All right.